When I use the brick on this reverb module, part of the player in reverb, I like to use feedback to get really long reverbs. On the first input here, you don't see it here. On one, I have the mix signal. On two, I have the wet signal. So I'm going on mix output first. Uh, remember, on this prototype, this sign here is not okay. This is attenu attenuator sign, but it's an attenuator, negative and positive, on the standard module. Huh? I did it. I corrected it. And also here, it's it's written internal, external. Actually, it's external, internal. So now I'm on internal feedback, means the signal coming here is coming here, goes through the reverb and goes back. And it sounds like this. So without feedback, I'm on zero here. I'm using the mix out. So it's quite a good reverb, but again, as said, I go on zero here, for instance, full counterclockwise, and I I add some feedback. If I put this on. So just in the middle position, it's already a very nice... Still, maybe you hear it, huh? it's still sounding. So if I go on wet now... Oops! It's even longer. <laughs> a nice sound, actually. So you can play with the equalizer, of course. Equalizer. Yes, so this was an example with some feedback.